AT&T and Verizon delaying launching new 5G wireless services near some airports. This comes after the nation's largest airline said that the service would interfere with aircraft landing technology and could add to the ongoing cargo shipping issues. Yeah, good afternoon. Both Verizon and AT&T now have said that they will voluntarily not turn on their 5G networks around airports, uh, despite them insisting that there is little to no risk. The airlines have been pressuring the cell phone companies and the White House to get involved, insisting that there is a risk that, in fact, 5G cell sites could pose a risk and undermine and threaten the altimeters that are used for pilots to come in and get an accurate reading of their altitude off of the runway, especially important in bad weather. The airline CEOs had said if, in fact, uh, the cell phone companies don't turn off 5G around the airports, then they, the airlines, could see massive cancellations and disruptions affecting hundreds of thousands of passengers. The FAA had already said it's worried enough about potential interference. It would not allow pilots to rely on altimeters coming into big airports. The question now, of course, is how long will AT&T and Verizon agree not to turn on their 5G sites and what kind of potential interference uh, are we looking at and why is it that the United States was concerned about interference despite the fact that 40 countries around the world have already deployed 5G technology and have not seen interference with their aircraft. Now the aviation industry says listen you're comparing apples to oranges here because in Europe they operate at a different level of power and the antenna are focused in a different direction than they would be here in the United States. Bottom line is that this hour, Verizon and AT&T have postponed their decision to roll out 5G around airports. The rest of their 5G network goes live first thing tomorrow around airports. It is delayed, which means there should be no impact on commercial air travel or cargo travel across the country. Back to you.